Perry. I didn't see you there. Today's Tuesday, March 8th. That's Jude. I'm Jude. And I'm Logan. So Jude, you seem quite enthralled over there. What you looking at? Well, not much, but I've got a singular piece of paper that says lunch. Weird. I have a singular piece of paper that says menu. Today's lunch menu will be in French and English. Let's head to the lunch menu and our guest, Journey Miolo, will announce it in French and then I'll announce it in English. Today for lunch, we will be having les poulets Alfredo ou lasagne avec la toast à l'ail, la salade romaine des mini carottes, fruits et lait. In English, that is chicken alfredo, lasagna with garlic toast, romaine salad, baby carrots, fruit, and milk. Thank you, Journey, for being our guest to say that. To continue with Foreign Language Week, we have Madame Miller with a story for us. Let's check it out. Hi, Perry High School. Happy Foreign Language Week. This is Miss Miller. My name is Madame. I'm the French teacher at the high school. And to celebrate National Foreign Language Week, I wanted to tell you a little story that you probably have never heard before. So the story goes a little bit like this. Once upon a time, there were two cats. One cat was an English cat. His name was one, two, three. And there was a second cat. That cat's name was un, deux, trois, because he was a French cat. And these two cats were one day um, making a bet, saying, hey, I bet I can swim faster than you across the, the English Channel. So one, two, three cat said, no way, I'm going to win. And un, deux, trois cat said, no, no, I am going to win. And so they swam across the English Channel. And do you know which cat won? Well, the English cat won. His name was one, two, three. The other cat, un, deux, trois cat, sank. <laughs> Happy National Foreign Language Week. Mimi's. <laughs> that one got me. I, I like that one. That one was funny. That was quite comedic. That was good. It was good. I laughed. Yes. Anyways, linker applications are now open. Applications are open to any current sophomore or junior and are available in Mr. O's room, 116, or Miss Cundiff's room, 222. You do not need to be recommended to apply. We will be back after this message. Man, I'm just like, I have a lot of bus drive home. Bro, I know, you know what I think? It's one of those little rectangular pastry sacks with the stuff in the middle and the spray lines. Oh, the spray goes across. Here at the Perry Pride Shop, we've got chips and goldfish and Oreos. To celebrate Women's History Month, All In is bringing you powerful female figures that have made a mark in history that will always be remembered. This week's woman is Irina Sendler, who was born in 1910 in Poland. She devoted most of her life to helping Jewish people during the Holocaust as well as the aftermath. She used her job as a social worker to be able to get inside the Warsaw Ghetto, claiming that to be inspecting the heavily guarded area. Once inside, she was able to connect with fellow activists while also assisting her in being able to smuggle children out with fake identities as well as hiding places. Unfortunately, Irina was arrested and was sent to the Pawiak prison where she was sentenced to death. Today's trivia question. How was Irina Sendler able to escape her death sentence in 1943? You can place your answer in the Google form linked in the PHS News email. The Perry Players proudly present The Wedding Singer, and it's coming to the Mattachone Theater March 24th through 27th. As a special deal for our Perry High School family, we will be selling student tickets in the school store before school and during all lunch mods for a discounted price of $5. You do not want to miss this opportunity, so come down to the cafeteria starting today and get your tickets. By the way, I think it's a great show. I, I'm definitely not biased in saying that, though. 100% not. Wow. 
With that being said, congratulations to our wrestling team on capturing the district championship. They also qualified 10 wrestlers to the state match later this week. Good luck, team. Frog dress giveaway! Ooh, yeah! If you would like more information regarding free prom attire, please contact Mrs. Matisich at kim.matisich at perrylocal.org or stop by her office in the back of the library. That's all we got for you today, Perry. Have a great day! Mon amour, on va tous mourir demain. Il y aura du soleil et de l'orage, c'est sauvage. Il y aura du vent, ce sera trop facile. Il y aura du soleil et de l'orage, c'est sauvage. Il y aura du vent, ce sera trop facile.